see if you look at it from this angle, it kind of looks like what is the random NPC. But actually, we're the player. But anyways, hey guys, very love you. Welcome back and let's play Persona 4 in the last episode. Uh, yeah, we we confirmed that Lisa has been captured and is gone forever. What's that? No, there we go. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold. Oh. Hold on. I'm screwing my mic. Hold on. Hold on. Professionalism at its finest. Uh, uh, there we go. Alright. So, <laughs> I don't know why I did, I, I don't know why I decided to do that like immediately as the recording started. But anyways. Alright, so here we are. Back with the Persona 4 and I'm creaking around my chair. So, right now we have to do probably one of my least favorite parts of the game. So, there's no real way to do this. But, um, uh -huh, I just gotta dive in and do it. So, I didn't look up, I forgot to look up a guide, I just realized that now, on how to do this part. So, what we have to do is walk in and randomly talk to everybody. Now they go from the ma magic commercial. My students weren't sure about it. They said, you know, why she would stop, because she's so cute. Well, not just at all, she may be an idol, but she's still a child. I prefer women a little older. Shut up. Enough about me, it's been hot lately, hasn't it? Okay, okay. So we have to go down and talk to like every NPC in the game and like, Try to figure out where you say is. Well, not figure out what she is. Figure out stuff about it. Problem is, like, you don't know who knows what. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Let's stay and listen. Also, you know, town really me out. All the time, time nice. I'm gonna, okay. Okay, so this guy, this guy's just talking about nothing. I'm busy, old man. Go get some coal yourself. Most of the quests, like, that would have been a quest. Most of the quests in this game, like, I'm not even going to do most of them because all of them just, like, get you irrelevant, like, prizes. They don't do anything special. They don't change anything at all. Except the fox one, so. The ones you do for the fox change things. So. I probably should look up the guy, but we'll just walk around talking to people. Because we haven't talked to everybody in the game yet, so we might as well do that, right? So this actually expands over a couple days, so. Well, actually, I think like two days. We're actually going to be heading into the dungeon soon, to the fourth? No. Is this the third dungeon? Yeah, this is only the third dungeon. What am I talking about? I'm crazy. Uh, maybe Chie knows something. Hmm. Um, yeah, well, we didn't go to. Yeah, we should probably check out that Le Tofu shop. Hmm. There's some person with a camera in one of them. I think it's called a Papa Rat. Papagati. Okay, so some people sometimes I see it so Papagati Zo and some Papagati. What's the difference? I don't get it. Is that just like I don't know. I never knew the difference between that. I don't know if there is a difference at all. But we gotta go looking for a cameraman. This one's not too bad if I remember. All I think all we have to do is look for the camera guy, but he's not gonna be at the bank, and then that's pretty much it. That's a good thing. But anyways, so how are you guys doing today? I'm doing all right. Oh, I didn't check what time I started the recording yet, and I didn't do my does. I didn't sync up the audio. Ah crap. Okay, so last episode for those of you who might have seen it before I edited it out with the YouTube editor. Oh, it's doggy. Hello, doggy. Doggy, doggy, doggy. Um, talk to you gently. Hmm. Oh, I ran away again. I think I have to sing to it or something next time. Hmm. Yeah, I think I have to change it to stay to it, but... Anyway, so I didn't sync up my audio and video, so... But last time, I actually forgot to edit it out because how that happened was because I usually... I only had, like, two minutes or something to edit the video. So I had to like put a picture in and all that. It's like I was like so it's gonna be late for work to edit this video and I had to like take a shower and all that. I edited it, uploaded, like started rendering it. And I took a quick shower. And then when I came back out like it was ready to roll, I did upload. But I didn't notice that I forgot to cut the beginning out. So like there's like a whole beginning of me just sitting there like getting ready to start recording. And then you heard my my secret, my deep dark secret of how I sync my audio and video. But for those of you who missed it, I guess I'll show you now because I totally forgot to do it before the before the thing started. 
So, how we do this, well, how I do this is, right, we'll just do it right here. Okay, so, what I do, because how I record it, there's game audio and there's my uh, voice audio. And those aren't always, like, sync perfectly when I set the recordings. I try to set them at the same time, but it's never exactly. So how I get it exactly centered is I go, I, I go through the, like, any menu like this. And what I do, every time I move, I, I just say duh. I just make a duh noise. You can make whatever damn noise you want. It doesn't matter. I heard some people make different noises, but I just go duh. So here, I'll sync the audio right now. So duh, duh. Da 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 da. There we go. And in editing, I'll line that up. So now it should be perfect. And that is how I edit my videos. And I I sharpen the videos a little bit. Like some some people can get like this game looking like perfect. I don't know how people do that. Like I just like sharpen the video a bit just because it looks a little dull. But. Beyond that, it's like, I don't know how people, like, get this, like, such high-quality videos. Like, I don't know how. I'm not a master editor, contrary to what some people may think. But, I don't know. Just, like, my stream. I try to, like, get my stream, like, the, the best quality I can. But there's so much, like, numbers and stuff. I don't really understand how it works, so. I don't know. Not that I stream much anymore. Man. I was thinking about the stream, whole stream thing. I think I have an idea for it, but that idea will have to... Well, has yet to be seen put into motion yet. Hmm. Where is the guy with the camera? Where is he? Are you him? Kanji knows where he is. Hmm. I don't know. We gotta find him. What? Okay, no. This is just some stupid guy. I don't care. Uh, what is the guy? I thought there was supposed to be a guy with a camera around here. Oh, maybe the old man knows something. There's an old man here. Where is he? Old timer. The idol goes there. There's a little another. I don't know. There's something like that. The shop. I hear you can think about it. By the way, I have a small ask you. No, it's not. I don't want to do your damn stupid quest. Everybody in this game wants me to do stuff for them. Hmm. Um. Okay. What the hell? Where's the camera guy? I have to wait till tomorrow for him to be here. I think that's what I have to do. Yeah, he's not here. Old man. The old fisherman's still here. I always wondered why, like, in this game, right after you get out of school, it's like, like the sun setting. Like, it's all energy outside and sun setting. Like, is it really that? The sun really set that fast at this time of year. Like, it's really, it's starting to, like, right now, where I am right now, it's like, it's starting to stay up, like, Super late. It doesn't go down until like 8 o'clock, which is crazy. I like it though. I like having sunshine when I'm at work. Mm -hmm. They're counting rocks. Okay. You keep doing that, kid. Okay, so I guess. I guess we have to come back tomorrow because that camera guy ain't here. That guy ain't. That guy ain't here. Unless. He wouldn't be at Yasugami. He would. He'd be in the shopping district. I'll do a quick run through the shopping district and then we'll head to what I next I have planned. I don't think this guy does anything. I'd probably look at the guide, but that's no fun, right? It's all about walking around, exploring for yourself. Hmm. He say he's at the riverbank. Huh, I think they're pulling my leg. I mean, he might be there tomorrow because I know we have to we don't do this all in one day. We might have to do it tomorrow. My chair is really squeaky for some reason right now. I'm not sure why. I don't know if my mic's picking up. It probably is a little bit, but my chair seems awfully squeaky today. The squeakiest chair around. Alright, I guess I guess the scumbag's not here. I guess he's here tomorrow. Oh well. I know I just said he's not there, but I have to make sure because if I miss this, it'll throw everything like, like so bad. Like, oh god, it'll be horrible. All right, he's supposed to be like right here. I remember he's supposed to be like right here somewhere. He's supposed to be like standing right here with the camera, but not there. Hey, 
Anyways. Ah, whatever. I guess we'll just... We'll, we'll play that he's there tomorrow. Then we'll go do what else. What else I had planned for today. Because tomorrow actually is a big day if, if that camera guy's there. If he's not, we're screwed. But tomorrow is a pretty big day. Tomorrow as in, like, game day. Today, we have to talk to this this game, buddy old boy here, Saki Konishi's brother. You don't even know his name yet. What do you want? Will you turn the handkerchief and talk with him? Yeah, here's your handkerchief back. I, I, I thoroughly used it when I was in the bathroom. There's no toilet paper in nature called. It had to be done. I could have just thrown it away. Huh? It was your sister's. Well, I don't want to throw it away then. Huh? Yeah, I'm sure it was a very happy handkerchief. Thank you. The very deep voice for that small guy. Express this good, dude. No. Thank you. Uh, you can answer anything here, doesn't matter. No, thank you. No, it's okay. But that handkerchief saved my ass, literally. Oh, I'm Naoki Konishi. Naoki. There we go. We learned his name. Damn right. Never mind. You hurt me. You cut me deep, man. You cut me a little deep. I'm sorry. Oh, damn, are you ready to say? Give me another handkerchief. Huh. Acquaintances. We're not friends, just acquaintances. So I, did, I never knew this guy's name until just now, Naoki. Alright, we'll keep that in mind, Naoki. Oh, faint bonds. <gasps> Gasp. It's time for the voice. What kind of picture is that? Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou has established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed when creating personas of the hanged man arcana. I guess that guy's hanged. He's like hanged by his leg though. Not exactly what I think of when I think of hanged man. Saki's brother. Can we call him Naoki now? We know his name. Whatever. Huh. Yeah, a little bit. They're a douchebag, though. What, you were fired? Really? Wow, scumbags. Left behind. Huh? I'm usually by the liquor store at the beginning of the week. Oh, okay. No, he's not a raging alcoholic. He is... His parents own the place, if you don't remember. It's like, oh man, I was hanging on the liquor store, man. Life's hard, bro. Jeez. Wouldn't he be like 15? Jeez. Welcome back. Welcome home. Ah, good old Nanako. But tonight, we cannot hang out with Nanako. Tonight is an optional night. So today we're going to fish. Because I read, I read up a bit about the fishing. And um, we want a couple fishes. Fishes, a couple fish for some sick, sick item that we'll be able to pick up soon. Just want to make sure we have enough of the fish. God, I hope we do. Need a couple of them though. Ugh, so missing, missing here would suck. I think you can get better fish at night, so that's good. Oh, there we go. There was that random button I talked about when we first started fishing. Ugh. Ooh. Need a trout. I don't want no damn trout. Only one more attempt? Crap. I want amber seamas. Or a goldfish. I actually think we already have a goldfish, so I think that's okay. But amber seamas is what I want. We need four of them. This doesn't make sense. How is this how is the string magically like shortening? Wait for defying laws of physics. Wait, is this another one? Genji, are you? I don't want this crap either. Whatever. Oh, we don't get to, don't get to talk to the old timer? I don't want to talk to him anyways. Scumbag. Uh, 
Ugh. Yo. Hello. Looks like it's gonna rain all day today. Hmm. It's a, it'll be okay for a while. It's okay. She just went in there. The game would give us like a couple days to get her out, even though that's the plan. Don't worry, we'll be okay. After school. Alright. Okay, so today is the day we're going to be heading to, um, to the next dungeon. You don't know what it is yet, though. Don't worry. Well, you'll see when we get there, but we're just going to make sure that scumbag's there. If he's not there, then we're totally screwed. But... I want to, we have to do some preparation H before we um, head to the dungeon, get items and such. Oh yeah, th this is him, isn't it? Oh yeah, it is. Hmm. Why don't we exchange information? People in the shopping area, I mean, you have me do it. All right. Let's let's swap information. She's different on TV. Hmm. Manufactured personality. Inquire further. Huh. So I have to find someone who knows something. Wait, I think we have to actually go to the school for this one. Hmm. Somebody who knows something about what you say. It's Kanji, isn't it? With this black umbrella. Well, yeah, you're too good for my clear one. It's clear, though. So we have to go find a big Lisa fan. I believe it's at the school. I believe. We'll go check, cause I I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Speaking of the sky, I can see right now out my window. I can see the sun. All right. Um, who's the big Lisa fan? Are you the Are you the big Lisa fan? Hmm. Oh. That's good that he's still hanging out here. It's this guy, isn't it? Um, uh, nope. Don't care about you then. Alright, so yeah. <laughs> I, I can't remember exactly where the person who claims to be the biggest say fan on Earth, but... Somewhere around here. Hmm. Oh yeah, she said it's a boy. Um. It's not King Moron, by the way. Hmm. Is it this guy? It might be this guy. What the heck? No, I don't want to. I don't hear a damn stupid story. Somebody here knows something. Damn it. Yeah, that's why I don't really like this part of the game. Like, I don't know. It doesn't really tell you much about that character. And it just kind of, you just gotta go down and talk to every, every NPC. Kind of uh, annoying to me, to be honest. But, okay, I think this is it. Oh, yeah, we found, yeah, you definitely are her biggest fan, aren't you? Hmm. Just want a status update? A little R and I. What does R and I even mean? I always see, I know I kind of like understand the meaning of it, but I don't know what, like, it stands for. I've always wondered that, but I never, like, Google it or ask anyone what it actually meant. I don't know. I, I understand it's, like, really, like, Oh, less than relaxation. <laughs> I don't totally just figured it out. Is that is that that's what it means, right? Less than relaxation. Oh my god, that has to be what it means. The blogging has some hints about why, but oh well. There's a lot of theories out there. Hmm. A fan club. Hmm. That's it? That's all you have to say? That's all the information you have to give me? Well, I guess it's more than anyone else. Alright, so that, for some reason, that's enough. All you have to do is, like, she has a lot on her mind. And then, like, that guy's like, oh, really? I can figure that out by myself? Is this reality? I do. Hmm. I think she's stressed. Hmm. 
can send living two lives more. That sounds about right. Well, you can give me any name, but thanks for the information. I can at least turn this into something. Hmm. A manufactured personality. Her true self. Alright. There we go. That's all we need. We need to head to Teddy now and head to the ne head to the dungeon. But we gotta get some preparation H done before we go there. Because we're not ready yet. I just gotta do some what's it called? Just stop by the store to make sure we have enough money and such. I can't remember if we actually stopped by Dideras and sold all the sold all the uh, junk to make some money for the fox, because fox money is good money. Mm -mm, no comments in there. Hmm. Oh well, he doesn't make stuff today. Oh, I guess we did sell everything. Whatever. What do you have for sale, old man? A bastard sir. You know, bastard. Hmm. I kind of want to buy some of this stuff. I kind of don't because, uh, a five iron. You really go that distance. Cause we don't really have what's called much money. We're kind of sort of really poor. Hmm. I can still like this weapon on Yosuke. That's still really good. Hmm. Yo, Kiku. Plus, uh, oh no, we're ne we'll like never trade this, the Suzaku feather, it's like, oh my god, it's like the best item in the game. I guess we'll just leave that as is for now. I thought we had materials to sell, but we'll find stuff in the what's it called, because we had chest keys actually, we made, we got some chest keys, so hopefully we can find some rare stuff in the dungeon. So I want to make sure we have enough money to sustain ourselves when we're in there. Alright. It's a rainy day, so we got some poop to do. Shut up! Alright. Marker? Soul Leader? Marker? Survives an ally and fully sells HP. Not bad. It is all on sale as well. Um. So what we want is. We gotta make sure we have. Some of this stuff, so we'll, we'll buy a couple of these. A couple of these nuts. Wait. You can only carry so many? Hey, I didn't know that. Uh, we'll go this many. Silence, buy a couple of these. Um, don't need those. Oh yeah, we need definitely some of these. A surplus amount of these. That should cover us for a few dungeons, actually. Uh, okay, we got enough of those. Marker leaf. Kind of want a couple of these. These are expensive as hell, so only buy two, just, just in case. And... Mm, why not? Uh, okay, we'll keep at least 20k for... What's it called? For... The fox, because we'll we'll be able to make some money in the dungeon as well, so we should be okay for now. Because it'll probably be close to 30k, I would imagine, to heal once we start leveling. And we also have kanji as well. Kanji could. So we should be okay now. Alright, so I guess that's about it. I guess the time has come. Alright, well, let's head to Juness and head to the TV. It's time to start our next dungeon. Oh man, this is only a third dungeon. I feel like it's like the fourth or fifth, but it's only a third dungeon. This game, how many dungeons does this game have? Well, I guess I shouldn't say that. It kind of spoils it a bit. I'll think to myself how many it has. So, one, two, three. Three, we done. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I just think to myself, it doesn't, it doesn't have that many. But. Like, but the thing about these dungeons is they weren't meant to be done in one day, I don't think. Like, you're, you're allowed to leave and come back. That's what I did in my first couple playthroughs, but it's not what I'm doing this time. What's the plan today? We're going in. That's what the plan is. <laughs> Let's go, team. Let's go, little squad. It's time to get the rescue mission rolling here. A log and rolling. Alright. Alright. Hey, Sensei. I did. 
Does he nose nose? Did you find out more about this girl, Brise Chan? I did. Uh huh. Her real self. I see. She's just like me, the delicate, sentimental type. The one trapped in a TV world. Then. Hmm. Oh, I guess in a way she kind of is. Not at all. Follow me. Quick, follow the bear. We're going in. Hopefully, I have to. I can't remember what persona I have right now, but I'll figure it out soon. Uh oh, where are we? What is this place? It, it's all dark. Should have got flashlights. What the? Huh? What the? I think we're in the wrong neighborhood. Uh. Oh, like the kind you always find in resort towns. <laughs> what, Yosuke? Oh, I think you're right. Huh? Yukiko? Uh, oh, oh, but we don't have one. Our end is not like that. <laughs> <laughs> of course it's not. <laughs> Damn it, Yukiko. Huh. So this is a strip joint, huh? Hey, you know, Kanji, just throw it out that what this place is. Stop beating on the bush. Strip? Zebras have, right? <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> not, not quite, Teddy. I think you like this a lot better than that. Strip? Like a zebra, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> not quite. <laughs> it's so bright here. Even with the glasses on, my eyes hurt. Glasses are meant for just like the fog, not UV rays. Get the joke? Okay, let's try one more time. Strip. It's something zebras have, huh? <laughs> I love how he's trying to like get someone to laugh at this. I'm laughing. You got me, Teddy. <laughs> Can anyone shut this thing up? Aw, leave him alone. Aw. Huh? Zebra? Uh, sorry, what are we talking about? <laughs> oh, poor Teddy. No. I won't say it again. Let's hurry on. <laughs> Aww, Teddy. Poor Teddy. Yeah, pinpointing his location. Well, apparently she's in a strip club. I don't know. What could, what could be going on in here? Well, if you remember what happened on the Midnight Channel. This could get a little dirty. We're going in. Team's filling out now that you you can try to count you on, board. All right. So this is the we actually the first time in the game we actually have more than four people in our party. Alright. Yeah, so we can't switch when we're inside the dungeon. We have to come back out here to switch up our team. But the team we're gonna be using for this dungeon, since we only someone has to sit out. Kanji is definitely on the team. And Yukiko definitely has to be on the team because he's a healer. So I'm gonna take Yosuke, because in the long run, Yosuke will be more important than Chie. Because, um, what? <laughs> Wait, what are, you, what are you talking about? But anyways, um, Chie really falls off, like, later in the game because she, she, she doesn't learn as many abilities as late game as, as, uh, Yosuke does. Like, Chie won't learn, like, the strongest spells, like, in the game, so that's why I don't like using her. And she's, like, I don't know, her attacks just don't, like, she's, like, a physical attacker, kind of. But then Kanji is like the physical attacker of the game. His his attack will like always be stronger than Chie, so if you want a physical attacker, why not just go with like the strongest one in the game, right? Good old Kanji. No, oh, Kanji's on board. Let's both give 200%. Alright. So we have a squad together, so we're going in next time because yeah, I'm gonna turn off here, so next time we'll head into the dungeon and yeah we'll get this thing started. Look at those lights, man. Colorful lights. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next time for the Strip Club. Or as it's called, Mother Q Strip Tease. So yeah, see you guys later.